Hello everybody and welcome to ProMine AutoCAD Tips and Tricks. Today we're going to be talking about the command fillet, which is a very useful tool to generate curves when designing a drift centerline in AutoCAD. So to use the command fillet, first we're going to design our drift centerline. In this case, this drift is going to be a ramp connecting the red level with the green level. So first I'm going to generate that centerline with the command polyline. I'm going to connect then from here this end of the drift to this other end. In this case you can see here that I already have limits so I know that my ramp cannot go further than that, than that distance so I'm going to use those points here and I'm going to connect with this drift. So now I have my center line ready but I know that that center line has only straight segments and I need curves because my because my equipment is not going to be able to go through that drift uh, without a certain uh, radius. So for that, I'm going to use now the command fillet. So I just need to type it in and press enter. And then I'm going to have these five options. In this case, I'm going to use radius because I already know the radius that my equipment needs. Uh, well, that all my equipment need to be able to uh, go through that, uh, in this case, ramp. So I'm going to go radius and here I just need to input whatever radius I need. In this case I'm going to type in 15, then I'm just going to press enter and after that I just need to select the object I want to get that 15 degree uh, radius applied to. So in this case I know that I generated this center line uses, using the command polyline so I just need to select polyline here. After that I just need to select the polyline, click on it, and that's it. I'll have my drift ready with curves of 15 degree. So that's all for today. If you have any comments or suggestions for our next tip of the week, just leave your comments in, your, in our comment section below. Thank you very much.